Hey guys, welcome back. Kyle Dimon here with Bullion RV in Duluth, Minnesota. And today we have for you a big one. It is a 3770 Suite by Cherokee. It's Arctic Wolf Limited. We'll get you on the outside, we'll get you on the inside. Let's see what you think. There's a lot going on, so you'll think you're really gonna like this one. All right, guys. This one is meant to bring the large family, the friends, the whole team, make friends at the campsite. This is have a lot happening, so stick with me, we'll walk around the whole thing and we'll see if we can touch base on everything. As you can see right out front, you got a couple big awnings with the blue LED strips to cover both doors that are going in. You got the camp kitchen in the back, good solid steps that come all the way down, outdoor speakers, just everything going on. The door is a friction door, so it won't slam open or slam shut if it catches the wind. That's a nice feature there. Slam latch baggage doors, really convenient. Hold up with a magnet so you don't got to hold it up while you're taking all your stuff out because look at the storage you have in here. Just massive amounts of storage. Really good space. You got cable TV hookup and power. You can run your cords right through here. You got a latch for your best friend, hook him up. Or if you got some bikes or something you don't want to grow, you know, walk away. It's got a 1500 pound capacity, so you can really hook a lot to that. Lock the bikes up while you're gone, bring the dog out. Motion lights under here as well. You got an armored underbelly tank enclosure. You got a couple of 20 pound LP tanks. Nice thing about these is if you run out, you can just pop those out, run to any local Walmart you know, Walgreens, swap those out. You don't gotta bring them in. You can leave the unit where it is. You don't gotta drive it in to switch them. Really convenient there. Like I said, a lot happening. We'll sneak up front. Big, beautiful front cap with a nice blue docking lights. LED on those. Got a rhino box. Under, you got your spare tire, your battery, your battery disconnect, a little more outdoor storage under here, auto leveling. I mean, and that's just the front of the side of it so far. The other side, you got another LP tank, the other side of your pass through storage. Convenient tank pulls right here. Water hookups, you got a shower with hot and cold outside. And then you do have a nice light at, for at night. Big slide, and I have the windows open on it so you can really get some light in there. Nice big slide. We'll tuck you around. Kind of bring you back. Really nice unit. You got more storage in the back. And then you do have another light under here too. Really convenient. And again, those slam latch baggage doors, can't beat them. Magnets, you're not breaking any clips while they're holding up. This does come on a 50 amp service. When we get inside, you'll see why. You have a backup camera already hooked up, way up top. Ladder to the lockable roof. Nice bumper. Gonna serve as where your sewer holes will live. So keep that out of all your storage areas, which is really nice. Outdoor camp kitchen. You know, you got a pull out tray for your prep station. Nice large refrigerator out here. I mean, an ice maker. Who doesn't need any more ice when you're at the campsite always seems like you're running out that's the one thing you run into town for the most ice maker nice storage you got a sink you got power light i mean it just keeps going another set of those solid steps that run you right into the bathroom it's a nice convenient you got a grab handle again friction door 
porcelain stool in there. You get really nice aluminum rims with a dual axle on here for the towing convenience. Just beautiful, beautiful unit. Bring you up the stairs, nice solid grab handle. Right as you walk in, again, if you're on this side of the camper, you can come up. There's another bathroom. You, there's a spot you can kick your shoes off, and if not, there's no carpet. You can just come swing right in. We'll bring you up this way first. So, this is the full bath. Porcelain stool in here as well. Nice size shower in here. You get the skylight for the extra headspace for your taller folks. Power fan. Nice big sink. You can fit both hands under there. Your GFCI protection. Nice medicine cabinet. Storage below as well. Really good sized bathroom on a pocket door so you're not swinging any of the doors open hitting anybody really nice convenient right there bring you into the master suite king size bed you got it set right there the suite windows on either side of the bed for a nice cross flow good storage over here wardrobe put some stuff up top you can hang some clothes if not you are prepped for a washer dryer in this unit so you can put that in here if that's what you choose to do. Again, this is on another pocket door. Really nice. Got a spot for a TV. Put a TV in here with your appropriate hookups above on the ceiling. Nice storage doors below. And a really big wardrobe. Again, with the hanger. Deep size to pack all your clothes all the way to the bottom. And then these are on some nice mirrored sliding doors and give you a nice more size storage over here for all the stuff you're gonna need. Under the bed, it has an assisted lift with the gas struts. You just pull that up, it holds up by itself. Good huge spot to store some good blankets and things under here. These two tables, can store under here as well and I'll show you where those go in just a second. So those are freestanding tables so you can bring them outside and put them out at the you know by your camp if you want to. Otherwise we'll walk you down. Again motion lights I don't know if you saw that but you got motion lights on the stairs at night. Bring it down if you wanted to you can see you have your big theater seating all these chairs recline just kick back, relax. You do got heat and massage on the end. Cup holders, really nice. So these are where those tables can live, right in front of here and make that kind of your dining space if you choose. You got, you know, arm storage for the remotes and all the other goodies. You got USB right in the middle for you. On the ends, like I said, you got the heating, cooling. You can turn the cool lights down on under it. You just got these cool blue LED lights all over, which is really nice. Makes it really fun camping. USB power on the side of the island. Nice big island right in the middle. You got the pull down faucet. Nice high rise with a black stainless steel farm style sink. If you leave that over, it gives you a lot more cutting, you know, counter space. You can move that to give you the more space. A lot of drawers. A lot of storage under it. Good microwave at eye level height right here. Three burner stove. With a nice heavy cast iron pleats. Little dual purpose. You got a cutting board backsplash there. 
under the stove, you got your pots and pan storage. And then to the side, really big storage doors too. And then you got a nice slotted storage for maybe some silverware, cooking utensils. You know, more doors above, you got the lights above, you got lights below. So you can really get some good lighting in the kitchen. That's one thing that I really like is nice lighting. AC unit in here, you got it ducted throughout. Nice lighting above, you got the blue LED. Speakers in the ceiling, you got a subwoofer up there. You know, just a lot going on. Really fun space. And then at night if you want, we'll show you. You can shut the lights off and just really have that blue LED kind of go everywhere and just really make it nice and fun at night for those of you who like to party and live into the nightlife. You got a fan. There's really a lot going on. Entertainment stand, you got a fireplace, so if you got plug in, you got free heat. Radio entertainment, another TV. Storage above. Just a lot going on. Get this cool farm style pantry with the nice smoky windows. Big pantry. Like I said, this unit is huge, so you're gonna need all the storage, all the food, all the cooking space. You're gonna bring along a whole team. Just a fun unit. Bring you back into the bunkhouse area on the back end. So you got that teddy bear bunk series, nice soft sleeping area with storage below it. You got storage to the side of it. Nice big storage there. Tucked in the back by the light, you got USB 110, big windows for ventilation. You do have the AC ducted back here. A nice bunk bed up top. You got, you know, more USB and more 110 up there with another window. And then you'll have a ladder. Your ladder will hook up. That's this ladder right here. This will hook up there to get up top. So just really sleeps a ton of people in this unit. Windows, you know, like you can open it all up. It's really nice. Again, another spot if you want more entertainment. Give another TV backer here. And then this brings you right into that half bath. So you do have your own half bath back here, like I was showing you before, from the outside. Nice storage. You got a power vent in here. I don't know if you can see, we'll see if I can bring it up, but you got a little blue umbrella, which means that if you turn it on and open it up and leave it open and walk away and it starts raining, that'll sensor and close right for you so you don't gotta worry about getting back and having water damage. Really nice, big, fun unit. This one will make a lot of friends at the campsite if you're not bringing all of them with you already. All right, there it is, guys. My name is Kyle Dimon. I'm here at Bullion RV in Duluth, Minnesota. You can reach me at 320-290-5834. We have a show coming up in the middle of February, so if you want to come see this, please set an appointment. At that number, give me a call or log on to our website. Easy to do there. Hope you had a happy new year. We'll see you soon.